Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing with you what I keep in my home caddy. So this is a tote from Molly Ollie and you can get it on Amazon and it's actually for diapers, but I use it for just carrying around my stuff from room to room. So I will link it below if you're interested. It's made of this really nice thick felt material. You can adjust the inside compartments. I love it, I'm a big fan. But I wanted to share with you what I keep inside of it. So I carry this upstairs, downstairs, around the house. It has everything that I need, usually after work when I'm lounging around, but I keep it next to my desk when I'm working so I can access the materials as well. Up first is my planner. This is my Erin Condren daily planner and it has a nice spring cover on it. So of course, always have to carry this around. Then there is a set of sticky notes in here for any pre-planning that I want to do. I usually keep it in my planner, but the dailies get so big because of stickers and whatnot that I find that usually I just have to leave it like floating around the caddy. Then I have whatever book I'm reading at the moment. Right now it's The Vanishing Half by Britt Bennett. Very good. I am over halfway through. Lovely story. Definitely one you should read. It is worth all the hype. It is very good. Then I have my planner stickers. So I try really hard to keep my collection concise and easy to search through. So this is all of my planner stickers in one place. And I love carrying this around with me because I find that I tend to do more memory keeping and journaling in my planner rather than like forecasting what's to come. I'm sure that will change as my life gets busy again. But I mean, it's still busy now, but like events and things in the future on the calendar. But I love having this and adding stickers here and there just makes things cute. In one of the two smaller compartments, I have whatever business book I'm reading. This one is What the Heck is EOS. I'm kind of looking through it to see if it's a good book to give to new employees to explain the way that we organize our company. We use the entrepreneurship operating system, in case anyone was curious. And this is a book for employees to understand that. Next is my journal. This is where I journal and I write and I put all my thoughts and my feelings and my emotions go into my journal. I actually finished one that I had been writing in for seven years. Clearly I didn't write every day for seven years, but now I'm onto a new one and I just have this Hello Kitty notebook that I've been writing in. So I keep this in here as well. And then next to that is my Clever Fox master to-do list book. So I write tons of to-do lists in here. This is where I do all of my brain dumps, anything business work, life related goes in here. And I add cute stickers and then cross it off with cute colors as I go along. So I have this in here as well, if any ideas strike me. And the last small compartment is where I keep my vlog camera. So I always have it nearby if the mood strikes. Basically, this is the bin of if the mood strikes, Kayla. She has what she needs close by. So I got my vlogging camera here. It's the Mark II G7X Canon and then a Manfrotto little tripod. I will link anything that I talk about. If I can get a link, I will put it below. And then I have my pencil cup. So this is a little dinosaur that we sell at the Oh Hello store in Grand Rapids. And I have all my mild liners, my scissors, my Sharpie S gel pens that I'm obsessed with. All of that is in here so I can plan and write my to-do lists. Then I also have a jar of Vaseline. I used Vaseline as a kid instead of like lip balms and I'm still, I'm still using it. I have these little guys everywhere. I think I own like six or seven of them, but I always want them close by. Like when your lips be dry, you need it close by. You can put that on my gravestone. So I actually don't keep anything in the side pockets um, besides my sticky notes. And over in this zipper pocket, I have batteries for my embroidery light. So I use a book light with my embroidery so that if Alex is like playing a video game downstairs, I can see my work, but not like have to have the lights on. So 
that's in there as well. I would love to know if you have like a tote or a caddy or a bin that you use to carry around your things in your house. I would love to know if you have one of those and what is in it. Does it look something like mine or are you like, Kayla, why do you need to carry all this stuff around with you? But I told you, if the mood strikes, I need it close by because by the time I walk to get it, the mood has no longer struck. So I just like having anything that I could need right next to me. But let me know in the comments below what would be in your bin if you didn't have one or if you have one, what's in your bin? As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe to see more videos from me two times a week and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.